welcome and thank you for joining us for today's encouragement from Our Daily Bread on the 29th of January 2024. The Bible reading today is Galatians chapter 5 verses 14 to 15 and verses 22 to 26. The entire law is fulfilled in keeping this one command. Love your neighbour as yourself. If you bite and devour each other, watch out, or you will be destroyed by each other. But the fruit of the Spirit is love, joy, peace, forbearance, kindness, goodness, faithfulness, gentleness, and self-control. Against such things there is no law. Those who belong to Christ Jesus have crucified the flesh with its passions and desires. Since we live by the Spirit, let us keep in step with the Spirit. Let us not become conceited, provoking and envying each other. Today's article titled Sharing by Caring, was written by Patricia Raybon. The young pastor prayed every morning, asking God to use him that day to bless someone. Often, to his delight, such a situation arose. One day, during a break at his second job, he sat in the sunshine with a co-worker who asked him about Jesus. The pastor simply answered the man's questions. No rant, no arguing. The pastor commented that being guided by the Holy Spirit led him to have a casual talk that felt effective but loving. He made a new friend as well. Someone who was hungry to learn more about God. Letting the Holy Spirit lead us is the best way to tell others about Jesus. He told his disciples, You will receive power when the Holy Spirit comes on you, and you will be my witnesses. The fruit of the Spirit is love, joy, peace, forbearance, kindness, goodness, faithfulness, gentleness, and self control. Living under the Spirit's control. That young pastor put into practice what Peter instructed. Always be prepared to give an answer to everyone who asks you to give the reason for the hope that you have. But do this with gentleness and respect. Even if we suffer for believing in Christ, our words can show the world that his spirit leads us. Then our walk will draw others to him. Let's pray. As I tell others about Jesus, please lead me, Holy Spirit, to speak with your love. Amen. Thanks for listening today. My name's Rebecca, and today's encouragement was provided by Our Daily Bread Ministries.